Today we're going to show you how to do a parasitic measurement on your Mustang Dyne. The way we do this is we have to shut the weather station off, the Excel filter value to zero, and run the parasitic measurement. To shut the weather station off, it's simple as calibration, weather station parameters, no inputs available, then press OK. Next, you're going to go calibration, dyno parameters, down here in the corner you'll see filtering values. Find the Excel, change that to zero, then press OK. Now we are ready to do the parasitic measurement. So to get to there, it's calibration, calibration, verification routines, parasitic measurement. We are going to have to name this parasitic. So, the, so what you do is you're going to go down here to select file. You look right here, it says write to file. I'm going to click it. And it's going to come up with the option for us to give it a name. And what we're going to do is we're going to name it today's date. And then just print save. Now here, if you see, it says highest speed is 120 miles an hour. To do the parasitic measurement, it is, requires us to take it five miles over. So you want to set whatever your highest speed is and go five miles above that. So all we have to do now is hit start test and we'll run the car up to 125 miles an hour, let it coast all the way down, and then we will view the parasitic. Now that the vehicle has come to a stop, we can view the parasitic. As simple as going down to view parasitic, making sure this is on power, and pulling the little tab up on the left hand corner of the screen down. As you see the linear curve, that is showing that we have a good parasitic. Now in case I did not mention, once we hit 125 miles an hour, we placed the car in neutral and held the clutch all the way until the car came to a stop. Once you see this, you, you, have a very, you have a good parasitic, and now we have to reset those two parameters back. So we will exit the parasitic measurement, go to weather station parameters, turn the analogs back on to use the weather station, press OK, and we will go back underneath our dyno parameters, and we'll change the cell value back to 
the designated value that was on yours to begin with. And then press OK. Once you do that, your parasitic has been done and you have a new parasitic.